Can we talk? Put me back in the dungeon with the other Shadow. We have nothing left to discuss. That's not true. I never really got to say that I'm sorry. Spare me. Your words are just as empty as hers are. <sighs> She's not evil, you know. She just wants what's best for Equestria. And it doesn't matter who she hurts in the process? She'd never hurt you, Luna. She loves you. She doesn't even know me. But I do. No, you used to. But at the first sign of trouble, you fled, just like every pony else. You abandoned me, Shadow. And when you finally reappear, you're the lapdog of some insane mare who wants to destroy magic? You just don't understand her like I do. Do you think I didn't notice you staring at that tapestry all those years in our youth? I couldn't understand why you loved it so much or why it would sometimes bring a tear to your eye. But it makes sense now. So what are you really? Some kind of demon spawn from the sister I never knew? I came from her magic, but that's all I know. I don't really have any memories before... you. And yet it doesn't matter, does it? Your loyalty still lies with her no matter what it does to me or any pony else. You are my world, Shadow. My brother. My only real friend. How could you do that to me? How could you keep secrets and abandon me when I needed you? You watched Celestia send me to the moon and you did nothing! And even after a thousand years when I came back, you never once came to me! Are you so blinded that you would push away the only pony who really cared about you just to chase after the demented dreams of an evil mare? It's not like that, Luna. I never stopped loving you. Take me back, Shadow. I never want to see you again. I'm sorry. Luna, I'm so, so sorry. I didn't know what else to do.